you know, sometimes old is better. Like a little bit of oatmeal, and if you're like me and you still got a sweet tooth and diabetes, and you know, whatever, why not dress it up a little bit? Uh, that's what I'm gonna do. This is non infused. And that's just some boiling water. I'm trying to cut back on dairy. I haven't eliminated it totally yet. But we can put the hand size and there you go. So gonna add a little bit of sweet to that. Probably teaspoon in there. And I learned to love it. Now, there we go, it's getting nice and thick, it's still nice and hot, and I'm going to add some protein. And this is one-handed, so obviously, you know, I don't want to shake for the shells, my hands are clean, and that's gross. Anyways, yeah. There's a fail video waiting to happen. Cracking one-handed when your hand is fucking numb. It's a little tough. But anyways, I'm just gonna add some protein to the uh, to the oatmeal, and I'm gonna strain that, but I can't show you doing that because I need my hand. There we go. We've got a higher protein um, oatmeal. I've uh, added a single egg. That's a nice bowl of oatmeal. The heat from the oatmeal. My fucking hand is still numb. The heat is going to uh, give us the benefit of cooking that. So it's kind of degrees to boil water, so that's Celsius for the American things. And uh, what is that, like 212 or something? Kind of high. There we go. It's thickening a little bit more, so it's going to be kind of almost cake. And of course, it wouldn't be complete without some fruit. Oh, just a couple of things. Uh, organic, local, well, organic, supposedly. Um, Mexican blueberries. Hopefully they are. But if they're not, uh, what I got going on is worse than what that is. So, just gonna let this stand a little bit longer and there you go I can to cook this is not infused but that's okay it's more like not soon enough I can feel a low coming on The other thing you can do is uh, buy legally produced uh, cannabis oil from your licensed producer. Open house. I can't cook, so what can you do?